So, who are we here with today? I'm Daryl Evans. I'm pastor of Salt Lake City Vineyard. Married for 40 years to my wife, Lisa. Wow. Three grown children and three grandchildren. The oldest is three years, and my youngest is five months. Wow. Yeah, okay. that good? Yeah, yes. very new to grandparenting. There. Yeah, I'm a late bloomer, but at least I'm blooming. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> so, yeah. um, tell me a little bit about how you got into coaching. Uh, about eight years ago, I went to a cohort training in Cincinnati, and I had no idea what I was getting involved with and it was with Bob, Bob Logan. So we did a two and a half day training and then it's a roughly almost an eight to nine month uh, uh, mentor training afterwards. So you coach and, um, and that was eight years ago and then I got certified seven years ago and I've been coaching ever since. Uh, Kim, that's just a great question because it's revolutionized my life in many ways and even my ministry. Um, and just to kind of give you a little caveat, I was a terrible listener. No. You know, I just, people would, you know, give me the scenic route to their story and I would just cut them off. Oh, no. I, was, I was really bad. I'm a, <laughs> this is a confession. So uh, one of the things about a coach is being present with somebody and listening well and while you're listening to them at the same time you're trying to hear what the Holy Spirit is saying so that so uh, and that I'm still learning that I don't want to say I'm there I'm still learning that uh, but that is a, a learned skill and um, uh, so that's one of the really biggest things that came out of it plus I find that it's really uh, in my wheelhouse as far as discipleship and drawing the best out of people years ago the Lord told me, Daryl, I want you to draw the best out of everybody. And I, I really embraced it, uh, but I thought it was because I have a little bit of a prophetic gift, and I thought, well, I'll just give them words, words, and <laughs> right. that was enough. It turns out that wasn't enough, okay. and coaching has helped me draw, do that, draw the best out of people. Oh, that is very special. Yeah, it is. Um, if you could talk directly to our participants about coaching, what would you say? Well, what I would say is coaching is, first of all, it's not the only thing out there. It is maybe a part of many very successful things like mentoring and consulting, counseling and spiritual direction. But it is significant in the way of helping you discover what God is doing in your life and then coming up with goals or action steps to reach those goals that Jesus has put into your life. Uh, one of the big upsides of coaching is you get a person that's going to walk alongside of you, like I said earlier, that's going to listen to you and listen to God and just walk alongside. You are going to have a person that prays for you and their one goal is to help you become all you can be in what God has called you to be. Oh, that is great. Thank you so much, Daryl, for your time. I appreciate that. Thank you, Kim. If you would like to make an appointment with Daryl during our inaugural retreat, check the comments below for instructions on how to do that.